Hey there, welcome back to The Magic in the Music. I'm Jen. Today I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on how to make payments on your Disney Vacation Club dues. These payments could be made using a Disney gift card, a Disney Rewards Redemption card, a credit card, or even your debit card. So let's get to it. There are two basic options for how you can pay your Disney Vacation Club dues. Option one is to pay off your entire balance right at the beginning of the year when the new dues statements come out. Option two is to set up automatic billing for your contract or contracts if you have multiples. And if you do that, you get to choose a due date. Ours happens to be the 15th of each month. I believe the first is also an option. So you're gonna to wanna to pay attention to this because if you set up the automatic billing, it will automatically deduct or charge you that dues amount each month. So it is the total remaining balance divided by the remaining months of the year. The reason I like to do it this way is that as I collect Disney gift cards throughout the year, I can take those and apply them towards my dues balance and then that reduces the payment that is pulled each month for my dues payment. This is a great strategy if you can get Disney gift cards at a discount, which we often do using the method of purchasing them at Target. Also, sometimes people will gift us Disney gift cards for holidays, things like that. And it's great because we can turn around and apply them right back to our Disney Vacation Club dues. So the first thing you're gonna to want to do is log in to disneyvacationclub.disney.go.com. There are two places where you can access your dues page. You can either go to your dashboard and then click on dues, or you can mouse over my DVC and you will see my annual dues on the left. So here we are on the annual dues overview page and it's going to show the remaining balance of your membership dues. If you have auto pay scheduled, which is what I have, you can actually see the contract dues balance for each one. You can see that we have some different contracts here and they each have different remaining balances on them. If you are enrolled in auto pay, it will show the amount for the month that is going to be automatically deducted. So on this contract, 3862, 9414, 3665. So you can kind of go through and um, see what they're about to take out. Of course, you can pay off the entire balance if you have that amount in your Disney gift cards, but most of us don't. Most of us like to just buy Disney gift cards as we go along, or sometimes you're given one and you just want to use it. This same method is going to work if you have a Disney Visa Disney Redemption card. So it's the same thing. You just enter the number in the same way. So I'm going to look at one here. Let's see. I have 9414 due on this contract right here. And so I'm going to go ahead and go into that contract and I'm going to pay off a hundred dollars. I happen to have a hundred dollar gift card right here. I'm going to pay a hundred dollars off of that contract so that they will not deduct that 9414 out of my linked bank account. So instead of going into manage auto pay, I'm going to click on pay balance. Now you're on the page where you can make your payment. Scroll down and click on pay by contract. Scroll down to the contract for which you wish to make a payment. Here is the contract for which I would like to apply my payment. I'm going to click on apply other amount because I have a hundred dollar gift card with me. Go ahead and enter the amount that you'd like to pay. You can see here it actually shows you where it is applying that payment. It is my 0.1 contract. These are all the same use here, so they show a 0.1, 0 0.2, 0.3, and however many you might have. You'll scroll down to the bottom, and here's your payment method. Click on the pull down menu, and you can see here I can choose credit card, Disney gift card, or Disney rewards redemption card. In this case, I'm using a Disney gift card. This will be the same method for a credit card, Disney gift card, debit card, or a Disney Rewards Redemption card if you have the Disney Visa. I'm going to select Disney gift card, and now I will enter the number that is on the back side of the Disney card. This is the account number, and usually they have 12 digits followed by four more that are spaced out that are covered up by a little um, by a little seal that can be scratched off. I actually grab them and peel them off. It's much, much faster that way. Click in this field, I'm going to go ahead and enter your card number here. 
Make sure you keep track of the balance on this. You can do that at DisneyGiftCard.com. Once you've entered a valid card number, go ahead and click Submit Payment. And here is my confirmation screen, and it gives me a confirmation number, a date, the amount, and the remaining balance. So from here, you can make another payment, or you can return to your dues overview. Let's return to our dues overview just to verify that our payment has posted. You should also receive an email confirmation for this payment. Sometimes it can take a moment for this to refresh and for the system to recognize the payment, so don't worry if you don't see it reflected here. I just hit refresh on my page, and now if I scroll down, yes, I can see that that payment has been applied. Now don't worry, it's still showing me a payment coming up, but that is now not going to be the payment for the next due date. That will actually be the payment for the following month's due date, so nothing will be deducted. I can also look back at the auto pay scheduled. You can see here that it has reduced the amount that I will be billed on my next auto payment. So that's it. That's how you apply a payment to your Disney Vacation Club dues in anticipation of an upcoming automatic payment. So if you have just one contract, this is actually really, really easy to do really quick and easy. Of course, you have the option of making the full payment in January each year, but if you like to collect those Disney gift cards, and many of us do collect them at a discount, and uh, that can be a great option and save you some money on your dues as you go along. So it's another really great way to save a little bit of extra money with your Disney Vacation Club membership. Hey, if you're getting value out of this video today, we would really appreciate it if you could hit that like button and leave us a comment. Also make sure you subscribe to our channel, of course, but it really, really helps us out on the channel and gets our video put out to more viewers. It's easy, it's quick, and it's free. So hit that like button, drop us a line, and let us know how you like to pay your DVC dues. Hey, we have lots of great videos on our channel here, so please be sure to check out this video here and this playlist so you can be sure to get the most out of your Disney Vacation Club membership. Thanks for joining us today. Bye, everybody.